Hello fellow collectors and welcome to Long's Toys. Today we are taking a look at the DX Memorial Progress Key Set Side Hidden Intelligence. So it's that time of year again. Obviously the previous Rider show has ended. We're actually a decent way into Saber at this point. But they're going back and giving us the Memorial Key Sets where they take the gimmick item you probably already have and make a new version jam-packed with phrases from the show. Uh, hopefully some more sound effects and everything. I will say that this set is a little different though because we actually get two new keys. So we are getting, of course, the memorial key for Aruto with the Rising Hopper, but we're also getting the Realizing Hopper. Although technically, let me check this again because its full name is not Realizing Hopper. It is Rising Hopper Progress Key 01 Realize Version. I'm going to call it the Realizing Hopper Key because that's much easier to say uh but anyway we get the real the rising hopper key the realizing hopper key and then we actually get the izu key as well so we're getting two keys that are exclusive to this set which is a good and a bad thing because i know some people don't really want to get these they're premium bandai so they're a little bit more expensive i can understand especially if you can't understand japanese i can't either uh, for the most part, words and phrases maybe. But in any case, I can understand why these aren't always a big hit, but you do at least get two new keys in this set. Here is the front of the box. Very fun. Obviously, zero one, one very big. Zero one, one very prominent here on the front. Uh, you can see the Hidden Intelligence logo there on the top. Kind of just standard safety stuff there on the bottom and on the side. And this side as well. Actually, this side just gives you a breakdown of what's inside the box. If we take a look at this side, another cool picture. You got zero one, one and then you got Izu in the background. So pretty cool packaging, very simple. You can see it's very thin. It just has three keys inside. So let's go ahead, get them out of the box, and we'll take a closer look. So here are the three keys out of the box. We have the Rising Hopper key. Now, aesthetically, looks exactly the same as the original. Even has, I believe, the same QR code, but I could be wrong about that, but it is zero, zero, 001. So if you want, you can completely use it like a normal key. It'll just keep cycling between those two sounds, and that's really all that it does on its own. But of course, if you hold the button down, and I'm going to move these two guys off to the side. We'll get back to them in a moment. We'll go ahead and start going through these sounds because there are quite a few. Ma 
ゼロワン。俺の時代の一号。始まりのライダーだ。わ<笑>かんねえだろう。俺もわかんない。でも。俺だけの力じゃできなかった。ヒューマギアを信じたから。できたんだ。頑張ってくれた社員を。ほっとけないだろう。あんたが何をしようと俺たちの夢は壊れない俺がゼロワンだあ誰かの命令で動くんじゃなくてお前が考えるんだヒューマギアだって夢を見ていいんだよ誰にも邪魔する権利なんてない人もヒューマギアも夢を持つのは自由だお前がジンを守ったのはアークの意志じゃないお前がジンの父親になりたかったからだそう願ったからだ滅びは変われるはずなんだ俺はヒューマギアを守る俺はお前が怖いだけど逃げない夢を叶えたいいつ君に頼みたいことがあるそれでも俺は俺の夢を信じる叶わないって決めつけたらどんな夢だって叶わない絶対に叶えられるって信じるんだ信じれば夢は叶うありえるよ夢に向かって飛び立てばじいちゃん父さん飛んでみせるよ水一緒に叶えようゼロツードライバーこれが俺の夢の証人と人工知能が共に歩んでいく証だアークお前を倒す仮面ライダーゼロツーそれが俺の名だその結論は予測済みだ俺とイズ人間とヒューマギアが同じ夢を見てるからさお前を止める Alright, so that is all the phrases. You can hear then it just goes back around to jump.、Uh, if we hold this back down, it goes back to the regular version.、Um, there are going to be some more sounds if we shift back into the memorial version and then use it to transform, which we'll get to in a moment. Uh, but that's it for this on its own as far as just cycling through phrases in the memorial version. But there are a ton there. It says that there are at least almost 40, 39, it looks like. So that's crazy. That is a ton of phrases <laughs> packed into this thing, and it's not even everything it can do yet. So here is the realizing hopper key, and you have that beautiful holofoil sticker there on the front. Very, very sparkly. So that's it for the、uh, kind of first mode. It's just the regular key sounds. But I love the translucent blue and the translucent yellow. QR code has it at 040. And I kind of like that fancier version of it shouting jump. So it's a really fun key. I like it a lot.、Uh, but we can, of course, hold the button down. So it just says Tosan Father when it shifts into the other mode. That's how you know. I thought it was a phrase at first and I kept trying to get it to shift into the mode, but that's just what it says when it's shifted in. So we have a couple phrases here.
ちは仮面ライダーだろう滅びお前を止められるのはただ一人俺だもうその必要はないだろう飛んでみせるよ夢に向かって伊豆君の名前は伊豆だどれだけ時間がかかっても教えるから俺たちの思い出も夢も心も俺の百兆個のギャグもな伊豆ラーニングの時間ださあゼロから立ち上げて1からのスタートだゼロワンだけにはいアルトじゃーそれでは、それを見つけたら、それを見つけたら、それを見つけたら、それを見つけたら、それを見つけたら、それを見つけたら、それを見つけたら、それを見つけたら、それを見つけたら、それを見つけたら、それを見つけたら、それを見つけたら、それを見つけたら、それを見つけたら、それを見つけたら、それを見つけたら、それを見つけたら、それを見つけたら、Definitely my most anticipated h u m i g e a r key. I figured they were going to lock it into a premium Bandai set or something. I kept waiting for it to be released. Well, it is finally here. Secretary. Secretary. Isu. So this has a ton of phrases.、Uh, I love the like, robotic looking bow tie. I think that's absolutely hysterical. This has a QR code of 058. Now, this one doesn't really have, like, it does have two modes to shift between, but in my mind, I feel like they could have just been the same because obviously there's not really transformation jingles and whatnot. I mean, we'll still try it out in the driver, but it doesn't work exactly the same as the rest. So I'm just going to go ahead and cycle through the sounds here.
どうして返事をしてくれないのですかアルト社長私に指示をお願いだから目を覚まして一緒に夢が叶えられるって信じますからだから起きてわからないただ止まらない止まらない離れたくありません失いたくありませんこれで終わりなんて嫌ですもっとあなたの夢を追いかけていたい当然ですこれはゼアの予測から導き出された結論ですからご無事で何よりです許しません許しません待って滅びお願いだからもう争うのをやめましょうヒューマギアにとって人類滅亡が本当に正しい結論なのか徹底的に検証すべきですあなたこそ人類の素晴らしさを理解していない人類がいたから私たちは生まれたそして生きることの意味を夢を心を教えてくれた同じヒューマギアなのに人間に対する考え方が180度変わってしまう本当に恐れるべきことは偏ったデータをラーニングしてしまうことなのかもしれませんでもまだ間に合いますアルト社長ならきっと滅びを信じたいんです私は信じていますヒューマギアだって心から笑うことができる滅びあなただって本当に人類を滅ぼしたいと思っているんですかあなたは矛盾しています心なんて必要ないと言いながら心から人類滅亡を望んでいる私は信じますあなたの心をアルト社長信じていますいつかヒューマギアが心から笑えることを滅びもいつか笑えますよねそれが、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、あなたはイデン・アルト社長ですねはじめまして私は社長秘書ヒューマギア私に名前をつけてください登録しました私はイズですアルトじゃないとアルトじゃーそれが、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、ええ、Uh, the Human Gear keys don't do a ton on their own, to be quite honest. So, having a bunch of Izu phrases packed into this makes me happy, and I just think that's a lot of fun. So, very cool, very happy with all three of these keys. But let's go ahead. We can bring in the Zero One driver. So, we can go ahead and use it like normal, but there are going to be a few new sound effects.
jump to the sky turns to a rider kick. So when you first authorize, you can hear that sound of like the giant metal grasshopper jumping around, and then you have some kind of after effects there, which is kind of neat. So definitely some extra sound effects at the end there. Now if we switch to the memorial mode. Now we have some more phrases. That should be the last one. Yeah, it's back around to the beginning. So pretty cool there. You got some extra phrases after transformation. So quite a bit more packed into that. All right, we'll go ahead and transform with the realizing hopper key. So really great sound effects there. I like that a lot. And then if we go ahead and switch it to the memorial version. Rider kick 
to the sky turns to take off toward a dream. So that's the only phrase. There's only one phrase after he put it in the driver. But still, a lot of cool sound effects there, and I really like the transformation jingle. Next up, the Izu key. Obviously, she didn't have a rider form. I would have loved that. I was kind of hoping she would get one by the end of the show, but obviously it didn't happen. Uh, but she does kind of have a transformation jingle here. Secretary. She doesn't really have any phrases when she's in the driver because she doesn't really have like a memorial versus like normal henshin mode. So because both of her modes are just kind of phrases, she doesn't really have anything when you hit the button in the driver. There is one last thing we can do because this does have a sound in here for 001. So if we shift to the memorial version. So I don't know how it knows it's in the Force Riser versus the Zero One driver. Maybe it's because of how it flips open the key. I really don't know. Maybe it has something to do with pins that get pushed down when it's in the driver. That's probably more likely. Uh, but in any case, uh, pretty cool. I think that's pretty neat that it actually knows that. So you do have one phrase in there for Zero Zero One. I think this is a pretty great set. I mean, honestly, I'm not a huge fan of the Memorial gimmick sets, usually because it's just a toy I already have, but now packed with a ton of phrases I can't understand. And again, if you speak fluent Japanese, then by all means, you're going to get a lot more out of this toy than I am. But I can understand certain phrases and things, so it's kind of fun. Uh, but like I said, at least with this one, you're getting two new keys. And we saw something similar with Geo, where that Tsukuyomi Ride Watch was exclusive to the Memorial set. And here we have the Realizing Hopper key and the Izu key exclusive to this set. So you're getting two new keys, two out of three are new. That's actually pretty cool. And they both look great. Uh, all the phrases and sound effects are great. And with Realizing Hopper, you are getting some new uh, like sound effects during transformation and everything. So even if you're not getting that much out of all the phrases, you do at least have some cool new sound effects and everything. I think it's a cool set. I recommend picking it up. I'm really happy that I did. Uh, I really like the look of the Realizing Hopper key, and I just absolutely love the Izu key. So I'm really happy I picked this set up. Now, this year they did, or I should say for this year of Rider, they did several different memorial sets. They kind of grouped them together by, like, subgroup in the show. So there's another one for Ames and Zaya that I have, and I think there's a Metsubo Jinrai one that still hasn't been released yet. So um, we're going to be getting a few of these. <laughs> so definitely look forward to more of these videos. But I still think it's a fun set. I recommend picking it up at this point, I guess because it's already been released Mandarake, Yahoo Japan auctions, uh, things like that. I mean, Toku Collectibles might have extra stock. I kind of think he just places orders and fulfills them, but you never know. You could look around. Um, but I would say probably Mandarake, Yahoo Japan auctions, probably your best bet if you're looking to pick this up on the aftermarket. Uh, but I like it. I think it's a fun set, and I'm kind of just happy Zero One is still giving us toys just because Saber's been a little lackluster. I've been enjoying the Saber toys. But the show's been a little lackluster, so when I get another Zero-One release, 
It kind of lets me revisit those characters, and I really enjoyed Zero One. <laughs> it might be it might be added to like my top five rider shows. I have to the list is always evolving and changing, but I really did enjoy Zero One, and so I'm kind of happy to get some more releases and kind of revisit that world and those characters because it was a ton of fun. So let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Please like, share, and subscribe. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and as always, thanks so much for watching.